This is our end of the year event where we gather to celebrate student success. We're very proud of the number of our students who win internal and external awards and at this event we like to emphasize how much goes into student success in terms of donor contributions, in terms of external scholarships, and in terms of all of the people from supervisors through deans through graduate program directors who help students along the way. Having this financial support allows me to focus on my research and academic development rather than spending significant time supporting my livelihood. When I heard about the campaign for a bold new Brock, I decided I'd like to make a contribution and I decided to honor my mother and I thought it would be nice to create an award uh, for one of our exceptional students in the MA in Studies in Comparative Literatures and Arts program. The awards that I've received have allowed me to not only spend time on research that I really enjoy doing, but also to take advantage of a number of wonderful practical experiences which I might have had taken up by time working. So I get to not only do the research in the field that I love, but work uh, in the field that I love. I support graduate student awards because I was a graduate student here at Brock, and so I'm well aware of uh, the importance of having these internal and external awards. And when I was a student, it made a great difference in my career, being able to focus on my studies and not have to worry quite as much about the uh, financial hardships that students can face, worrying about getting part-time jobs, that sort of thing. Funding for students is an extremely important investment. Too many students are forced to decide not to pursue higher education simply because it is not financially feasible. Not only is it costly, but opportunity costs must also be taken into account. This unattractive combination pushes students to choose not to pursue higher education. Many valuable students are lost in this way, not developing their potential which would benefit themselves as well as the world at large. Donor awards have allowed me to focus on my research. Now I do not have to focus on getting as many hours as I can at a part-time job. I can focus on my schooling, doing my theory on extreme value in statistics. One of the reasons we set up this Memorial Award for Mike Spirinello was that we wanted to assist students in a small way financially to be able to pursue both their research and their extracurricular activities. The awards that we receive as master's students, I really feel that it's not just benefiting master's students, but that it actually is allowing us more time to help individuals in the communities. It benefits us in our own research, but it really does expand past the walls of Brock University and into the community to allow us to help individuals within and around the Niagara region. I want to acknowledge and offer a heartfelt thanks from behalf of everyone at Brock, from behalf of our students, on behalf of our faculty, on behalf of all of the staff, for those supporters and donors in the room who have shared their gifts with us. We are very fortunate in Ontario that there are matching funds for graduate awards and we're able to match on a one-to-one -one basis. So we still have lots of opportunities for matching out of the Ontario Graduate Student uh, Fellowship Fund. Um, and we have a couple of other programs too that permit matching depending on the students and the criteria of the award. The really important thing about donor supported scholarships is that at an event like this donors can be in touch with the students who have actually won their awards and they can see their gifts in action and that action is really powerful. It's going to change the world.